in 2017, the Chippewa Valley Veterans Foundation was created as a nonprofit organization with the dream of building a gathering place to honor and remember the service of our veterans from the Chippewa Valley. In 2020, and we had our first big piece of the tribute was the dedication of the 140-foot U.S. flag that you see when you are driving on Highway 53. Uh, last summer, we had the dedication of the mall area, which is the main gathering place, and the dedication of the first 500 veterans legacy stones, which honor individual veterans. This year in 2022, we're going to emplace and dedicate the first bronze statue to the veterans of the global war on terror. It's a place to remember and honor the service of the men and women from the Chippewa Valley that served and fought in our wars throughout our history from the Civil War moving forward. Because life is about people and veterans are very special people. And we want to connect the veterans service with the wider community in the Chippewa Valley. From that standpoint, not only is it important for them to be remembered and honored, but it's important for the larger community just to understand the sacrifices that the veterans have, have gone through and, and what they've done for our community and our nation. I would encourage you to sign up for Rock the Riverfront. Community is only as good as the things it cares about. And Rock the Riverfront is one of those events where it's primarily a 10K race and a mile race, but there's things for everybody. There's a carnival atmosphere in Phoenix Park. Get into the wind tunnel and grab some cash or get your face painted. So even if you're not a runner, you can go down to Rock the Riverfront with your family and have a great day and a great time. So any funds we receive from this event, we plan on putting into our memorials and our statues. Our philosophy from day one has been to build something that is unique, something that is impactful, and something that is as worthy or as, as impressive as any national park or memorial in the United States. As we all have dreams, but in order to make dreams a reality, we need a lot of supporters and we need a lot of assistance. We're entering into the most important phase of the veteran, Chippewa Valley Veterans Tribute. That's the educational phase and the historical phase where we're gonna gather a lot of stories of our local veterans and we're going to not only have statuary, but we're gonna have QR codes that tell interactive stories of what men and women from the Chippewa Valley did. And to make this happen, we need support from a lot of individuals and businesses and people throughout the Chippewa Valley. Thank you.